secret sauce, but between me and you, the secret sauce is just Thousand Island. So if you don't find this exact secret sauce, it's Thousand Island. All right. Yep. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that's how I wanted to come out today. All right. Really sauce it up. As you can see, we put a lot of mayonnaise already, making it look like a tiger with all of its stripes. All right. I'm going to put a little bit of some Creole seasoning. Tony's cha cha cha. Just like that. So, this is going to be an easy onions that are completely ready to go. I had to thaw these out because, believe it or not, they didn't have fresh onions at the store so we're just going to put a nice layer right there and move it around just like that perfect you want a nice thin layer now if you don't like onions you could go without the onions but i promise you this dish will not be the same i absolutely absolutely love onions but we are going to be swapping. Look at that. I got my fresh pickles. And they are going to go into this amazing little fun gadget. Let me make sure that is on. Fresh. Just like that. So we're just going to pick out a good amount of pickles. And we're going to drop it in here. Now, believe it or not, I love pickles that are sliced like this. If they're dill pickles, like the long form, or like just like regular like pickles, not cut up, I actually don't like them. It's actually really interesting. I don't know if I don't I like the the crunch or whatever it is, but for some reason, I got to have them sliced up. Ooh. Now, this could be a whole nother recipe, but I don't know if you've ever had a turkey sandwich and you put pickles like that, crush up some Doritos, mm. and you eat it like that. So, with this, it's going to look like you starting a lawnmower or a pressure washer. That's how it normally. If you had a pressure washer or something. So we're really going to go at it, y'all. Just like that. Let's show you the ingredients. Ooh. Look at that. Yeah. It, is relish pickles? I think so. Because this looks like relish. <laughs> ah, wow. I didn't know that. Let me know in the comments. Are relish pickles? Because after cutting this up, this looks like relish. All right. So we're going to take out our blade. I'm gonna move it to the side. Gonna get our beautiful. Let me use this so we can make sure that we get it all out. Mm -mm -mm. We got pickles, pickles, pickles. Now, absolutely smells delicious. Go ahead, slide it all out. Mm -mm. Dang. Just splashed rye with some pickles. Alright. Let me go ahead. We're going to mix this. Put that just like that. Make sure you got those layers. You got that beef. Now what we're making here, we're making a hamburger casserole. So you got your beef. You got the mayonnaise. You got the Thousand Island your onion, your pickles, everything that you would basically need for a burger. A cheeseburger. This is why we got that triple cheddar cheese right here, y'all. Uh -oh, let me go ahead and grind this up just a little. Okay. 
can't go anywhere. Got a little bit of cheese. Gonna really soak in. We've got the cheese. Ooh, this smells absolutely delicious. And the easy thing about it is the prep time was like 10 minutes. This is gonna go in. All done within an hour. But last but not least, we need our carbs. We've got our tater tots, baby. Go ahead and take a nice little cut in the corner so that these could just roll out. You just want them to layer them nicely so don't empty out the whole bag. All right, you guys, it is done. And look how crispy those tater tots look. And if you look closely right underneath, that cheese is melted, baby. All right, so let's go for this corner right here. Uh-oh, it's cheesy. It's exactly what we want. Oh, y'all. This is going to be good. All right, let me get my little mitten so I can pull this out and show you guys look at my y'all look how cheesy that looks oh my gosh it's falling apart oof you guys see the pickles the cheese the tater tots mm 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 now this looks delicious. Now let me put this right over here. Let me move this just a little bit. Made a little bit of a mess, you guys. But if you're not in the kitchen making a little bit of a mess, that means you're not doing it right. All right. I got a little bit of lettuce that we're going to open up and sprinkle just on top. Because you got to have lettuce for your burgers. So we're just going to sprinkle a little bit of lettuce just like that gonna add some more of our secret sauce perfect I'm gonna add some real bacon bits so this is going to be a double cheeseburger casserole now once it's done, we're going to go ahead and get all the ingredients, tater tots, meat, cheese, everything. Oof, looks hot, looks delicious. Mm-mm-mm. Mm -mm -mm. Y'all, this did on taste like a burger. Like for real, and it's not even a burger, like it's a casserole, like this is. Mmm. 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 Yep. That was delicious, y'all. Mm. Guys, this is a hit. Go ahead and make this for you and your family. Now this is super good, and I wouldn't have made it any other way cheese ground beef tater tots onions pickles thousand island mayonnaise perfect top it off with some lettuce and bacon more of that good sauce there you go